Okay, hello guys, this is 13 the m and here with a re-uploading of the tutorial of how to do the jumper effect on Final Cut Pro X. I did one, but it wasn't that good, so here's a new one. I got screen flow, so it's going to look better. Okay, so first, you need to record your background, and then yourself, where you are, jumping. Like right there, you see? Okay, so first we put this in and we go to where you want to start press B for the blade tool cut it right there A for the pointer again just delete that and to where it ends around right there so B again cut it A tool for the pointer and then you want to see where you want to do the jump so press B again for the blade tool and I want the jump right there okay and then since we're jumping we have to cut out some parts right there press A again to zoom in just go over here and delete the middle part that is when you will be jumping like teleporting I mean so then you put in your background I recommend recording your background at least five seconds because you never know when you're gonna need how much you're gonna need sorry so you just shorten it you won't need that much for this one let's see well about that is just fine let's see how it looks right now See, it looks good. It looks like I'm teleporting, but there is no jumper effect. So to put in the jumper effect, you go to transitions, blurs right there, and choose directional. You can just set it in between each clip. And yeah, shorten the transitions. So about minus 13. That should be good. Well, minus three on this one. All right, so let's go to the beginning and see how it turns out. Let's make this clip a little longer. So we would have to delete the transitions. Okay, so put in the transition again. Why did it shorten it so much? I have no idea. We'll move this so it gets more in the middle, right there. And just shorten it. Okay, let's see how this turns out. That looks kind of good. Still not where I want it. About there. Transition. Mm, right there, add it in, and again, put this so it centers it, then just make it short. Alright, let's see that from the beginning. Hmm see that again 
for some reason this transition we couldn't see that let's make it a little bit longer right there always try to keep both of your transitions at the equal time or else the effect won't look so realistic Ah, oh, there you go. Perfect. Thanks for watching, guys. This was the tutorial of how to do the jumper effect on Final Cut Pro X. Please subscribe, leave comments, and have a nice day.